Well, Mike, uh, this is obviously the goal all year was to get to Frisco, to get to Toyota Stadium. Uh, now that you're here, I'm sure uh, it's kind of hard to contain your emotions. Yeah, definitely. Uh, the goal is just not to get here, though. We, we, don't wanna, we just don't want to come here to participate. We want to come here and uh, go back home to normal with a W. We'll talk about uh, the journey and when you kind of looked around at your teammates and thought, this is a group that can win a championship. Yeah, uh, it, it goes back to the winter conditioning. You know, we uh, we all started going hard, grinding in winter conditioning. You know, then we went in spring ball. We had a pretty good spring. Then the off season, going in that summer, we picked up Trey. You know, he was a big piece of this team, and just we had a great fall camp, and we just been playing really well this year. And and I knew from the whole time that if we just played the way we were capable of, that we had a good shot of making it down here to Frisco. Obviously, this week is different than any other during the regular year. In addition to getting your work in, there's a lot else involved in the service events with some fun stuff you get to do throughout the course of uh, today and tomorrow. How, does, how do you adjust and, uh, and still keep your eye on that ball game on Saturday? Yeah, you, you have to do these things. You know, it's great to uh, do community service for the community and everything, but we're down here for one thing and one thing only, and that's to win the football game. So we got to stay focused. We have to have that uh, at the focus of our attention at all times. Looking around and seeing you've reached the pinnacle of FCS football. Uh, what's going through your mind? Uh, we made it, but but not yet, because uh, it's not going to be really uh, come to fruition until we finally get to hold up that championship uh, plaque. And so we're still waiting on what happens Saturday. Uh, your teammate there talked about uh, the off-season work, and you kind of looked around and thought, this is a group that can, that can reach the title game. For you personally, when did you kind of have that epiphany and like, this is a championship caliber ball club? Well, I started to see it. I got hurt last year, and I put in a lot of work to help see this team. And even though we had a down season, I saw that guys were, were hurt by that. And I saw that um, we, we were not uh, satisfied with what we did. So I, over the off season, you know, you saw guys in the weight room um, doing extra things outside of the football program. And, and uh, everything just came to this year, and uh, we're looking forward to finishing it. Anything uh, you're thinking about as far as just making sure the focus remains on that game Saturday when all these other activities are swirling around you when you reach what is essentially a bowl type atmosphere? It's not too hard for me personally to, to stay focused on what we have to do. Um, you know, we've been through so much ups and downs, but uh, we've done so much practice. I've been here, you know, five years, fifth year senior, so I, I know how to play football and, and I know how to lock in when you need to and, and tune things out when you need to also. All right, well, your young men are obviously uh, focused and, and ready to roll, but uh, I'm sure you personally looking around and seeing where this team has reached, I'm sure it's uh, personally satisfying to know we made it. We're at the FCS Championship. Yeah, we're very proud of them. You know, they've worked very hard. There's a lot of guys before them that uh, kind of set the foundation for this to happen. And uh, this group has been a lot of fun to coach, and, and then uh, to get here is a uh, quite accomplishment for them. You talked last night about how uh, your previous experience coaching in bowl games might help uh, in, in this week. Anything in particular that you told the guys to keep them focused while also enjoying their experience? Well, you can get caught up in all the hoopla. You just got to stay focused on what's important. And uh, this is a little different in that it's a championship uh, uh, game. Uh, I, you know, when you're, when you're getting ready to play with such a long layoff, your offensive passing game is what really, really struggles sometimes. So. That's that's uh, we have to get that up to speed pretty quickly on Saturday. Uh, just coming up tonight, uh, when when all that other stuff is, is swirling around, I, I assume you just kind of have to tell the guys, you know, for for a few minutes, these are college kids; they know how to have fun. So yeah. go ahead and enjoy yourselves. Yeah, enjoy it. You know, smell the roses as you walk through life, and uh, this doesn't happen all the time. And uh, you know, take advantage of the opportunity and just uh, enjoy it while you're here.